Hey everybody, this is Clover, and I'm back playing some new games. Uh, this time, we're going to try out a little bit of the Sonic the Horde Chig. That's right, we're going to be playing Sonic 2, uh, because this game is an absolute classic. Uh, another game that I've never beaten before. Uh, another game that I'm not super familiar with, so don't judge me too hard. Um, it feels like there's only one button in this game which is jump. Um, so, yeah. Um, you know, everybody everybody has uh, has their own exposure to, uh, to, to uh, Sonic. Ah! Uh, but, yes, I never, I never really got to, to play this very much. Um, I had a friend who had a Sega, uh, and I would play Sonic, uh, Sonic 3 and Knuckles uh, at his place. Uh, but yeah, this, this one was kind of, kind of lost on me because I was a Nintendo kid. I was all about, uh, I was all about, um, I was all about Mario. I was all about the Ma Pfft, Wonderful. I was all about the Mario. Um, but yeah, I mean, uh, as I said, uh, Sonic is an absolute classic. Uh, can't be denied. Um... I'm not the hugest fan of the gameplay. Uh, it is it is a little too fast for me. Uh, and, you know, I feel like so much of it... Like, it's a brilliant design uh, for a character, uh, but you miss so... Uh, you miss so much of it because... Uh, because so much of your time is spent... No. So much of your time is spent... Um, uh, just kind of flying through these levels, um, and you know that, that I think I think that can that can be a little a little troublesome on the game front, but on the gaming front. But uh, yeah, I mean everybody everybody has their own opinions about about Sonic the Hedgehog. Um, but. He is without a doubt one of the most iconic characters, and uh, his new movie just came out. <laughs> the The Sonic Two just came out, which is great. Um, unfortunately, I didn't get enough rings, uh, or I just used all of my rings, so I won't be able to get the uh, the bonus stage there. Uh, oh well. Ugh. Yeah, I'm not. A super fast reaction, reactive gamer. Ah, barely, barely missed the, the. Uh, oh, come on, man. I'm gonna blame Knuckles on that one. Knuckles. I'm gonna blame Tails on that one because uh, I would have not gotten hit if he hadn't hit him. <laughs> um. Yay! We beat the level. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but yeah, um, I know a lot of uh, I know there's a lot of uh, people who love the uh, who love Sonic. Uh, OK. <laughs> Wonderful. Uh, I know there's a lot of people who love Sonic. Uh, so, yeah, if uh, if you are one of them, why don't you comment down below and let me know about your uh, your history with this game? Um, uh, it's a. Uh, a very interesting series. Um, oh gosh, uh, it's a very interesting series because uh, because uh, I mean it was so different than anything else at the time uh, when it came out. Uh, like you, uh, you know, there's there's a lot of different game styles today, uh, but this was I, I feel like one of the first uh, games that required flinch reactions. Um, in, in your game. Did I get it? Did I get it over there? No. Okay. So yeah, the, uh, for those of you who are not familiar, uh, uh, I think every time you, you, uh, you finish a level or, uh, I think every time you get past one of those checkpoints. Wonderful. I think every time you get past one of those checkpoints, you have an opportunity to get a bonus level. That's the uh, the Chaos Emerald stage, or yeah, you you basically have an opportunity to 
to go to a to an area uh, where you you can uh, compete for a Chaos Emerald, but um, uh, I don't think I've had enough rings uh, any of the times to be able to do it. All right, so I'm gonna avoid the the Robotnik, and I'm gonna bonk him on the head if I can. Yeah, yeah, bonk that Robotnik, Sarnik. Or jump right over him, whichever you need. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I'm, I'm not super familiar with Sega history just because I didn't have uh, a Genesis. Um, but, uh, yeah. Um, but, um, oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Eat it, Jim Carrey. <laughs> But yeah, because I didn't have a uh, because I didn't have a um, uh, uh, Sega Genesis, I I didn't have much background on Sega. I remember like I have a faint memory of like when I was very young, like two or three, going over to to a family friend's house and them having a Sega. But um, yeah, and the only the only like I think that might have been even a Sega Master System. I don't think that would have been uh, would have been Sega Genesis. Um, but the, uh, yeah, uh, that would have been Sega Genesis, uh, that would have been Sega Master System, I think, uh, um, and, uh, yeah. Pretty, pretty cool. I, I do sometimes wish I, uh, this, I was, I suck at this, so please don't make fun of me. Okay, all right. So this this area can be very tricky because there's a couple of uh, areas where you can get thrust underwater. Or maybe I'm am I remembering am I remembering Sonic Mania? That might be Sonic Mania. No, I think this is Sonic Two. Uh, but yeah. Um, Yeah, I played. I've tried playing. I, I don't know if I've ever beaten this game. I don't think I have. Uh, but uh, okay, this is this it? Yeah. So uh, the the um those those moving block. Oh, thank goodness. Those moving blocks you see, they are all um, they all uh, they they can have the opportunity to crush you if you don't move quickly enough. So you got to be a real Sonic about it. <laughs> um. Okay, I don't know what that noise was. Like, would have expected to be able to. Ooh, would have expected to be able to like get a one up or something. Maybe that's not how Sonic works. Okay. All right. Oh no. So th that's another thing that's kind of kind of interesting about Sonic design-wise is that there you th the movement is so fast, right? It thrusts you through the through the the areas so quickly, but there there is like a lot to explore. You would you know what if you can if you could take your time on uh, if you could take your time on the levels. I think there's a lot to see hey, there. Okay, this is this is what I remember. And a game over. <laughs> oh boy. Okay. Will this take me all the way back to the beginning? Yes, continue. Hopefully it's unlimited continues. I don't like the days of limited continues, I could tell you that much. Okay. Do I have to go through through the first area again? I think I do. Which is fine. No, this is the second area. Oh no. Okay, up. Uh, Alright. This is the area that I used to get stuck on a lot, but meh, that went okay. It's a little bit easier on okay. Maybe this is it. It's a little bit easier to get stuck on uh on other consoles, like uh, I played Sonic, I think on like a couple of different consoles. I played uh, Sonic Two at least. I played it on uh, the PSP. I played it on this. I played a lot of Sonic, uh, a lot of Sega games on PSP, as I uh, said in my uh, 
when I was doing Castlevania Bloodlines. Um, uh, but uh, I think that was just one of the few places that I had the opportunity to be able to play Sega games. And most of my Sega exposure uh, came as an adult, um, just because, you know, that was the only opportunity I ever had to to play them. Yeah. Um, but, uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. Yes, I have... The, the way people have, have nightmare dreams about... Okay, why did that happen? The, the way people have nightmare dreams about... Uh... About... Oh, sh... Doobie-doobie... Okay, this is... This is what I remember having quite a hard time with. Okay. Alright, cool. Well... Every time... Every time the... The water level rises... Well, there we go. Can we get out of there? It's gonna... The, is the music gonna start soon? The panic music? <laughs> yes. Okay, got out. Oh, jeez. Okay. But yeah, I mean, I think that's a. Uh, I think that <laughs> goodbye tales. Um, I think that's a. Uh, that's one of uh, one of uh, Ego Raptor from or Aaron Hansen from Game Grumps. I think that was one of his common complaints about. Oh come on, man! That's one of his common complaints about about Sonic. That you're hurrying up to slow down, and it is kind of annoying. Ugh. okay. All right, you're hur you're hurrying up to slow down, and that could be very annoying, right? Okay. Oh come on! Yeesh. And that, like, why would that kill me? Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. Man, it's like he complains about every game he has difficulty with. That is indeed the case. Okay. Uh, 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 uh. But yeah, I mean, in terms of in terms of things. The premise of, of hurrying up to slow down seems odd. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Um, I had, uh, so what, the one, uh, the one Sega console I did have when I was a kid was the, uh, Sega Saturn. Uh, and I had Sonic 3D Blast, which I know is not a, uh, a very loved, uh, uh, a very loved Sonic game. Uh, but, um, I did have Sonic 3D Blast, uh, and I beat the heck out of that game. I loved that game. It was so good. Oh, gosh. Ugh. Well, at least I'll get a life <laughs> to immediately use. <laughs> oh, man. Don't take my friend. You can't take my friend, spider guy. Okay. Okay, boop. Uh, all right. Oh, man. Okay, great. Mm. 
Yeah. Yeah, the slowdown paired with the, uh, paired with the, uh, paired with the, uh, the, um, the, sl the, sl the game slowdown paired with the, uh, paired with the slowdown of the water is, a uh, is a little bit, uh, anxiety, uh, provoking. Uh, okay. If I'm patient, will anything good happen? No. <laughs> no, this is Sonic. Of course nothing good will happen if you're patient. Ah. Uh, see, look at that. Like a spring to, to thrust you into the water. Or the poison, whatever this is. Okay. Why would I have assumed that? Yeah, there's a lot of design problems with this game. <laughs> oh well. Okay. Alright, so I can only stand in that. Can I... Bonk him? Yes. Okay. What next, Robo Snotnik? <laughs> Robo Snotnik? See, the other thing is, like... I would love if this game had the, had the control of Mario, where, like, if you bounce off of something... It um, it gives you the opportunity to 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 basically like bounce again off of them, uh, you know, where you can jump like in Mario. If you jump on a spring, you can uh, you can hit the jump button right at the right time, and it'll uh, it'll launch you up. But that doesn't happen here. With Aquatic Run One. I think that is a perfect place for us to call it today. So thank you guys so much for joining me. Come check me out on the next episode, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks so much for joining, guys. Bye.